Alrighty, today we are going to get our feet and our legs nice and strong. So I'm not gonna do any intros, I'm just gonna like have this be a follow along. It's pretty simple, but I want you to be focusing on the actual like mechanics of the movement as you're doing them. And that's why I'm keeping it really simple. So like when we do tendus and when we do degages, making sure that you're really trying to brush through the floor, you're thinking about keeping your legs really nice and straight. And of course, we don't wanna forget about our upper body, even though this is like a lower half kind of workout slash exercise class. You wanna keep your core nice and tight. You wanna make sure that your arms are being held in place by the muscles in your back and all that good stuff. If you have any questions about what I mean by any of that stuff, please feel free to leave a comment below if you want me to make a specific video on it. But let's just get started, follow along. All right, we're gonna start rolling through our feet and doing some releves. All right, in parallel, we're gonna press over our feet. Six, seven, eight, you press, so one, two, three. Now plie, press over, rise up again. Go, one, two, three, four, plie, press over, rise up again. This time you're gonna start with the releve. So releve up. Four starch, plie. Last time, one, two, three, four. Releve, four starch, plie. Now releve up, up and down. Two and three. We're gonna go all the way to eight. So give me five and six. We're gonna hold at the top on eight. Now hold, balance. Make sure your weight is evenly distributed across all of your toes and you're not scrunching your toes in. Go ahead and plie, first position, same thing. Pressing over one and two, three, four. Plie, press over, up and down. Again, one, two, three, four. Plie, press over, up. Again, but reverse. So start with the releve. So go up and over, plie, straighten. Last time, releve up, plie, press down. Let's releve up, up for eight, two, three, four, four more, six, and seven, eight, hold at the top. Check in on your posture here. Is your core tight? Are your ribs closed? Keep holding. Really press through the floor. And five, six, seven, relax. All right, moving into tendus, degages, and round de jambes. They're gonna be very slow. First position, four to the front, four to the side, four to the back, four to the side. Tondus first, both sides. Here we go in a five, six, seven, eight. You go front and in. Two, really working through the floor. Three, and four, to the side. Make sure that your standing leg is also really nice and straight and you're not rocking your hips side to side. And four, to the back, make sure it goes straight behind. Two, and three, four, to the side again, brush. We're thinking of that heel coming forward, rotating from your hip. Other side, we go front and close. Two, standing nice and tall. And four, to the side. Now if you'll notice, I never really close my first position all the way in, and that's because I am hyperextended, and my legs don't really allow me to do that. To the back. If you can close your heels without overcrossing your legs, go ahead and do so. And four, to the side. And two. And three, four, good. Take a plie, 
straighten, releve up. We're gonna do all that again with degages. Five, six, seven, eight. You go brush. Two, three, four. So you're coming off the floor just a little bit. Three, four, to the back. Two, three, four, and side, out, and out, and out. To the other side, brush, brush, and side. Two, three, four, to the back. Two, three, four, and side, side, and out, and out. Plie releve, and hold. Let's go ahead and take our arms out to first. Start getting those arms engaged. Bring them out to the side, and finish. All right, rond de jambes from first. We're gonna go really slow, a little faster, and then fast. It's not that fast. Go ahead and keep your hands on your hips here. Feet in first, five, six, just follow along, seven, eight. Really slow, point it front, open side, carry back, and close. Again, nice and slow, open side, bring it back, and in a little faster, front, side, back, and front, side, back. Both legs super straight, because now we're gonna do it quicker. So you go front, around, front, and three, four, four more, five, six, seven, eight. Take a plie and stretch, little releve. We're gonna do that whole thing again, but we're reversing, so starting to the back. Here we go, and a five, six, Seven, slow, point it back. Open side, bring it front, close in first. Again, slow, rotating that leg around, bring it front, close it in a little faster. Back, side, front, close. Back, side, front. Two more, just like that. Now we go fast. Back around. We're trying not to rock our hips. It's very difficult. Five, six, seven, last one. No releve, just plie. I'm gonna restart the music, we'll do the other side. Alrighty, here we go, legs nice and straight. And five, six, seven, slow. Bring it front, open side and back and in. We're drawing a nice big half circle with our toes, still brushing through the floor. Like you might wanna think like you're in the beach, on the beach, and you're dancing through the sand. I think I did too many of the slow ones, sorry guys. That's what happens when I start talking. Back, close it in a little faster. Front, side, back, and front side, back. Again, one more, front, side, back now, quick. Front, around. Still pushing that sand, ooh, don't fall. Five, six, seven, last one, plie, and straighten, little releve up and hold, we're gonna do to the back, or reverse. Five, six, seven, slow. Back, open side, bring it front, close it in, and back. Bring it side, bring it front, close it in a little faster. Back, side, front. Good, make sure it comes through first position, Two more. My legs are burning. Now fast. Back, around. Two, three, four, 
three, four, four more, six, I'm falling, seven, and eight. Plie finish. All right, next little section, we're gonna get our feet moving some more and do some small jumps. Always thinking as we jump of pressing those toes off of the floor as high as you can get them off the floor and pointing your feet as hard as you can from the ankle, whether that's in parallel or in first position, because we are gonna start in parallel again, but just follow along and just concentrate on your feet here and like having power from underneath and just getting yourself up there. I don't have anything else to say. <laughs> so we're starting in parallel. We're gonna do little presses, like points with our feet. So you're gonna go right and left, right, five and six and seven. Now add a little jump, go right, left, right, left, Keep going, five and six. Now we're gonna do sautés in parallel. Go up, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Plie, take a little rest. We're gonna do that in first position now. Starting with our little presses of the feet. And a five, six, Seven, go. Press, two, three, five, six. Add a jump. It feels kind of silly, I know. Now sautés in first. Up, two, three, four, six, seven, eight more. And five, six, seven, finish. Catch your breath as I explain this last jumping exercise. We're gonna go from first position, four sautés in first, one, two, three, four, four in second, so jump out, I should pay, two, three, four, bring it in for two, one, two, bring it out for two, one, two, and then bring it in, one, 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 one. And then we'll repeat that again, starting in second. So we'll go jump up on one, two, three, four, then bring it in. One, two, three, four, bring it out for two. One, two, bring it in for two. One, two, then one, 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 one. Finish exactly how we started. You are gonna be very tempted to stick your booty out as you do these jumps and jump like this. Please avoid that at all costs. Think of being in a toaster. So you're the little piece of bread in the toaster and you can't Go like this, because you're gonna burn your backside. <laughs> and you can't go like this, because you're gonna burn your front side. So you wanna go straight up and straight down, pushing off the floor, even when you do those second position eschapes. Push through the tired feeling, the fatigue, because that's how you get stronger. Let's do it. I probably won't talk much because I will be out of breath. <laughs> All right, as soon as you finish the first set, we we'll start again in second position. So no stopping in between. Hopefully y'all can see me. I know the light keeps changing. I'm so sorry. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, and second. Two, three. Now two, and two, and one, one, one. In second, you do four, two, three, in first, then two, two, one, 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 finish, you're done, good job. Great job today, I'm so proud of you for joining me. If you enjoyed this little class, please make sure to give the video a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already because I post tons of videos like this, and let me know down in the comments what you want to see next, whether this was challenging for you or you want something harder. I also just wanted to say that I started a new Instagram page just for dance content. So if you're looking for an easy place to find like quick tips, then follow my Instagram. It's at dance with Kayleen with periods in the middle. I'll put it up here and down below. I'm also on TikTok. Find me everywhere. Send me a message. Say hello. I love to connect with you guys. And I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Bye.